Some actions are precious. They define the world we live in, the world we wish to live in. But when it comes to energy, for too long now we've gone on making the same old mistakes, lulled by the illusion that energy is inexhaustible and cheap. We were wrong. We have to rethink the way we act, devise a new blueprint for our future, right now. For Europe, this is a duty, a priority and an opportunity. The European Energy Efficiency Plan lays the foundations for taking up this challenge. Looking ahead to 2020, the plan is to step up renewable energy use by 20%, making a 20% cut in our greenhouse gas emissions and our energy consumption. It's a specific objective, make savings. We need to consume less and consume more efficiently. We need to incorporate energy efficiency into our daily lives, our streets, the places in which we work and the houses we live in. Houses with practically zero energy consumption focus on the principles of energy efficiency down to the level of the private home. Without reducing our well-being, what we need to do is cut the monthly bill. Such houses can achieve an 85% reduction in energy consumption as compared to a traditional house. Building with an eye to energy efficiency is the rational choice, the money-saving choice and the environmental choice. It's a realistic option and a positive step. Here, everything is done to make optimum use of energy. Every component part, boilers, filters, pipes, glazing, shutters or solar panels, is designed to reduce costs. It means investing, of course, but it can pay off quickly. In the not-too-distant future, Intelligent meters will be analyzing our consumption and helping us adjust the way we use energy accordingly. Europe is committed to promoting energy performance in buildings. For existing buildings, the EU has created an energy performance certificate. From now on, anyone selling or renting out an office or a house will need to obtain one. And from 2020, New buildings will all have to be nearly zero energy consumption buildings. Looking at the business world, a company like Ocas ArcelorMittal has found a way of completely overhauling its energy matrix. It started with an energy performance contract with an energy services company, hired to reduce energy consumption. The end result has been a 21% cut in the energy bill. This concern to do better often produces outstanding results. This brewery ran an energy audit and was able to improve the firm's actual productivity. Closer monitoring of the new hot and cold water tanks and the brewing vats makes for more effective monitoring of product quality. The added gain in output comes on top of an energy saving of 30%, a good model for other small and medium-sized businesses to follow. Think energy means more than just thinking savings. It also means thinking competitiveness and jobs. By 2020, energy saving will have generated jobs for 2 million Europeans. New professions and new ways of working. They may sometimes involve simple actions, but they make the difference between waste and efficiency. These new approaches are set to become an everyday reality for us. The motor vehicle industry is already producing low fuel consumption tyres. Less greedy. Cleaner engines. Every day, new dishwashers or refrigerators are being awarded the a Energy label. Manufacturers are working to bring out other electrical products worthy of bearing the label. Because energy consumption has become another factor in deciding what to buy, alongside quality and price. Energy efficiency is a cause we must carry forward. It doesn't mean giving up living or producing, but we do need to become aware of the world we are now living in. There are certain ways of doing things which define us, certain ways of acting which preserve what is precious. We have a choice.